Hello out there, this is DZ, and welcome back to Let's Play République. <laughs> so we're going to continue right where we left off. We're going to listen to the other uh, tape that we found. Zager here. Today, all Prisrak were required to report to the reading room for a mandatory audience with the Overseer. Wait, I'm sorry, correction. The few and the proud were pleasantly surprised to find themselves graced by a visit from the Big Cheese himself. <laughs> his Majesty treated our hometown heroes to a few select passages from his manifesto. And after all the applause, he even sat down to sign a few copies. So about this time, I'm off, I'm wandering the halls, doing a bit of reconnaissance, when some FOB Prisrak found me and dragged me along. As luck would have it, I had a manifesto with me. But it wasn't any old manifesto. It was mine. The edited version, where the pages are filled with righteous invective and disciplined truth. Like I've said before, my manifesto is the old man's death warrant. A summons for all the evil he's wrought into this place and beyond. Well, hmm. at least it will be once I can crank out enough copies. I'm <laughs> kind of running a one-man opera here. Uh, <coughs> where was I? Oh, yeah. So, all of a sudden, here I am, being hustled up to the podium to meet the man himself. And before I can hide the book, he snatches it out of my hands, opens it up to the first page. Behind the mask, I'm white as a sheet. I'm waiting for him to look down to see my, you know, improvements. I froze. And he just smiles, that big plastic smile at me, and kissed me as John Hancock, under the words, best wishes. <laughs> so he hands it over. Off I go, and, well, here I am. I wonder if that smug Treglazov could appreciate the irony of signing his own death warrant. Yeah. I know I do. Oh, wait, I remember. What was this? Search. Um, search? Did I, did I get anything? Really? I didn't get anything? Huh. Okay. Um, search, 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 god fucking damn it, search, I don't, don't understand what's happening. Do I need to go out and come back in maybe? Did I glitch it somehow? I'm just gonna try that real quick. It might not do anything, but... She didn't actually say she found anything, so I mean... Like, I don't know. There's no other camera in here. Am I too close? This is weird. This is being weird.
I, I, I don't know. I give up. Getting some weird message at the bottom right as well. buddy. Maybe, it, no, it didn't give me an extra taser. I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I give up. I hope it wasn't something important. Uh, sigh. Hmm? Okay. Moving. Right, 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 right. Go through... Go through. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, so we're going back into the library. Okay, that took a little longer than I expected. And was a bit sillier than I expected. this little room. Oh! Oh, that's where we... Okay. Gotcha. Hmm. Someone coming. Maybe. Not too worried with my seven tasers.
post secure. Oh. He's just up these stairs. Librarian! Librarian! Uh-huh. I get the feeling this isn't going to go well. Senora Tavo? Librarian! Oh, no! Oh, crap. How did I know? You're making it up. Oh boy. Stop it. This isn't made up. Is that a bird? The girl activated a video that appears to have been recorded only moments ago. I presume it relates to the dead librarian. Probably. It's important that we determine what happened. Yeah, I'd say so. However, She's not accustomed to witnessing violence. It's difficult to anticipate how it will affect her. Oh, God. Oh, God. Um. Watch with hope. Watch. Oh. Damn it, game. Is there multiple endings? Watch with hope or watch uh watch alone. Whoa. Senor Octavo. Just the man I wanna see. Hello, Derringer. To what do I owe this pleasure? Good book. It is a classic. Not just a classic. I mean it's actually good. How can I help you? Why does this guy, Edmund Dantes? Dante. Dante, right. Why does this guy tell Maximilian that his girl is dead? For revenge. No, Maximilian's his friend. Yes, you are. You're right, of course. I... <laughs> Damn it, man. You, you have read this, haven't you? Of course, yes. Uh, no, uh, I meant uh, it has been a while. Why does Dantes put his friend through so much misery? I... I think the point is to teach a lesson. You cannot know happiness unless you have been exposed to a tragedy. Can't know hope without despair. I believe that is it, yes. It's kind of like the pre-cows. They don't know up from down, good from bad. They got no perspective because they don't have a clue about the outside. Or do they? This is an intriguing intellectual exercise, Dillinger, but it is late and I... Why'd you give the kids the poison manifesto? I, I, I did not. What are you doing in that hidden room downstairs? What room? Think we can't hear that god awful music bleeding through the walls? I, 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 just, I, I just read and. Uh, Reading Sega's trash! I, I have seen it, yes, but, but I, I would never act on it. Conspire against us. No, you were planning to help the no. children escape. No, didn't you? I. Uh, <laughs> Oh boy. What happened? The beautiful lie, you've earned a trophy. Oh God.
Oh god, was that the wrong choice? I don't... I don't know... I don't know... I really don't know... Oh god... Oh god... I don't want to get a bed... Uh, oh no... No... <laughs> How important are these choices? Is it simply me sparing her some, like, tragedy? Senor Octavo? Si, I am Luis Octavo, yes. My name's Quinn Derringer. My employer contacted you. Yes, of course. The mystery man who pays me twice what I ask. Did he receive the books yet? He did. And he thanks you. He'd like to thank you personally. Of course. Tell him to come in at any time. He's not in Buenos Aires. Is your passport in order? <laughs> My passport? What is this about? My employer has some more work for you. Mystery man? What sort of work? That's the mystery. Where would I go? Oh, impossible. I cannot close my shop. My employer thinks you can. He'll pay whatever you ask. He doesn't even know my price. But he knows you have one. You got a number in your head, senor? I do. Good. Double it. Where's your passport at? Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, wait a minute. How long will I be gone? Just a few days. I promise. Lying bastard. Octavo shop sign. Oh man. Oh man. Okay, well, hold on. I'm a little relieved you chose not to show that video to the girl. Still, it feels a bit like censorship, keeping it from her. Uh Damn it. I look, I don't know, man. The Count of Oh boy, that's what he was reading. The Count of Monte Cristo. Oh boy. Whoa, whoa. Okay. I uh... Spot Wait, what? Is it not one of the banned books? Oh. Okay. Okay. What's over? Okay. Dear Senor Octavo. Thank you so very much for giving me a copy of Labyrinths by Borgia. Each of the stories was fascinating. I especially enjoyed the one called The Library of Babel. It made me think of you, surrounded by all those books, overwhelmed with the infinite number of ideas they contain, and left wondering which books contain the truth and which are false. Is it true you knew Borgia and discussed literature with him? If so, I am positively envious. Thank you again for the stimulating read. Your friend, 390H. Hmm. Okay, well, we're not leaving yet, that's for sure. Hmm. I'll hold on to this. Okay, that's one of the banned books. Pain is best read as a comedian librarian. For pain, constitutions come from rights, charters create chaos, and monarchs require oversight against corruption from all whose interests fall short of the state's well-being. 
We are beyond constitutions, charters, even monarchs. We are communication itself. These so-called rights of man must not radicalize anyone into thinking otherwise. What? I don't even know what he's talking about anymore. The guy's a fucking nutcase. Everything looks good. <sighs> oh man. I I don't know if I did the right thing. I really don't. Whoa. Go to that camera. Is there another book over here? Quiet tonight. Whoa, that sounded really close. What? Okay. We can exit through here, I think. Or is this one of the confinement rooms? Oh, it's a bathroom. We're gonna get in trouble, Leap. No, we're not. He would never turn us over to Mireille. He might if he caught us smoking his cigarettes. Don't drag on it so long. How do you know about this stuff? I read a book. One of Senor Octavo's books? No, it was the manifesto. He has a whole chapter dedicated to smoking. <laughs> You're making fun of me. <clears throat> what the hell's up with that bird? Okay. Oh boy. Okay, well. I found a cassette. Okay, that's a Zager tape. don't know if I made the right choice or maybe the choices won't make like any significant impact and they're solely just you know moral choices I get what oh right Zaker tape okay yeah yeah, yeah. it's fine camera am I switching oh god is it inside that the other room I hope not yes it is well then I accidentally switched back to this I'm an idiot okay I see something. 
Maybe. Shite. Okay. Okay. That's more than I can Claire. carry. Is it? Okay, you can't get behind there. Fine. Not quite sure what to. I mean, I guess we'll try and get back to the Zager's hideout. So we can listen to the tape. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Saving. Okay. Does it save every time we switch cameras? music coming from behind the first floor bookcase. Derringer accused a librarian of having a secret room. Could it be behind the bookcase? Maybe. I guess we'll check that out in a minute. I can't carry anymore. Oh. He must have just had uh, pepper spray or something. Okay, he's down for good. Okay, so just to be safe, we're gonna lock that. Charge. Good idea. We can recharge here. <coughs> Cell data. Welcome to my domain. Care to purchase? Sorry to see you go. All right, we're going to end it here. All right, well, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, a comment, subscribe if you want to see more, share it with anyone else you think might enjoy it. If you want to suggest a game, leave it in the comments below. Check out links in the description for Republic on Steam, although this is the PS4 version. Um, and there are a few links there if you wish to contact me more directly, feel free to do so. And well, in the next part, we'll look into the secret room that the librarian had. Until then, though, this is DZ. You guys have a great day, and I'll see ya. <laughs> <laughs>